Hi everybody, this is Ann Emery with Excel for Evaluation. Let's pretend that you've already analyzed your data and you've highlighted some of your key findings in a chart, but you made the wrong type of chart. Maybe you made a bar chart and you meant to make a column chart or vice versa. So what do you do? Do you start all over? Do you start from scratch? In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the type of chart you just made without starting from scratch. Let's take a look at our data. So in this example, I want to show how many females and how many males were served by a program. So I have the genders in column A and the number of participants who were served in column B. So let's just insert a chart. We're going to highlight or select almost the entire table, everything except the total. Go up to the Insert tab and let's put in a column chart. So just click on Column and we'll select the very first one, a 2D clustered column chart. And let's pretend you actually meant to insert a bar chart. So you could just delete it and start over, but if you've already started tweaking it, maybe you've changed the font size, maybe you've cleaned it up a little bit, you probably don't want to start over. So there's two ways to do this. First, you can right click on the body of your chart and just go to change chart type. Right now, we have a column chart, and let's say you want to change it to a bar chart. We'll just scroll down until we see the type of chart we want. Let's put this one in instead. So just click on it then click on OK, and it changes it to a bar chart for you. The second way to change it is to go up here to Change Chart Type, and you get the same screen. It's the same exact thing. So right now we have a bar chart. We can change it back to a column chart. Just click on that little icon, click OK, there's a column chart. So that's how to change the type of chart without deleting it and starting from scratch. Thank you very much.